guys, welcome back to my channel. Two weeks ago, I was at, as usual, the SM Makati Beauty Department. And I, well, I have found out way before that uh, Sleek Makeup was coming out with three limited, new, three new limited edition palettes and I Divine palettes and those are the On The Horizon. Good night, sweetheart, and Nordic skies. So I went to um, SM Makati to get my hands on at least one or two of them, but sadly I only got the On the Horizon palette, which is this one. You can see that's the one that I got, and I plan on getting the Good night, sweetheart, because I really love the swatches I saw online, but unfortunately they didn't have it in stock and. Um, I was also there last week and they still didn't have it in stock and the sales girl there told me that they only had maybe a limited amount of it and then they ran out and they weren't going to stock it again. Hence why it is called limited edition. So I am hoping that if I get the chance to go to another um, branch that I will find one in stock because I really love the shades and those. Anyway, so they have Nordic Skies, and I was a little bit hesitant on that palette because it was all kind of, I don't know, pastels, and I'm not sure how I can pull off pastels, although I might in the future maybe get it if it's not too late yet, but as of now, if I'm not sure, 100%, why do I keep saying 100%, if I'm not sure 100% about a product, I do not get it okay so anyway back to the i divine on the horizon palette this one i am so glad that they had this in stock because this was my number one um choice and then the good night sweetheart because i wanted to play around or experiment with the orange shades that they have in this palette so as you can see i have it on my eyes right now i'm just not sure if it will show um, well on camera, but in person it looks pigmented and gorgeous. I don't know. Can you see it? I hope it shows well on camera. I'm not sure. I'm using the front face same camera of my Samsung Galaxy S7 because that's what I use to film my videos as of the moment because I have no budget for a real camera. <laughs> uh, hopefully you will get there in the future, but yeah. Anyway, it's really gorgeous in person. Um, it's colorful and it looks cleaner you know, for lack of better word one thing that i wish sleep makeup would have done is um, put the uh, cover design on the palette as well because once you unbox it um what we have here is the you know regular sleek makeup eyeshadow palette in black and you have here on the corner, bottom bottom right corner, it says here, On the Horizon Limited Edition. So yeah, it would have been nicer if, you know, if they had the design on the palette as well. So that being said, I guess I will have to keep the box because it's gorgeous. I love it. And hopefully it doesn't get ruined by me accidentally splashing water on it. But yeah, anyway, so this is what's inside. As you can see, I have my nails. <laughs> okay, please excuse the nails once again. Anyway, so yeah, as um, so you can see, this is what's inside. These are the shades in the palette. And this was what convinced me to get um, this uh, the On The Horizon palette. And as you can see, I have here taped, I taped here on the mirror the film which indicates their shade names and i got this idea from another vlogger or a beauty vlogger looking at the palette you will notice that there are three matte shades and the rest are all shimmers but once swatched there are some shades such as the raindrop that came off more satiny than shimmery also the dawn shade which is the deep blue one is more matte than shimmery 
I think it is also worth mentioning that the beach shade is not really that noticeable even as you pack it on. So what I do and what I suggest you could do is use that as your base for your eyeshadow instead. I am really glad that this palette on the Horizon palette has um, two mattes and um, two that are sort of matte but not quite because um, you can see hints of shimmer in them. But I am glad that they have those shades. Personally, I find it kind of hard to work with all matte or all shimmer in a palette. I like them uh, mixed, um, some shades with matte and some that are shimmery. So that's a plus with this one. Because I noticed that I have two other palettes besides this one. And I have noticed that they have a lot of shimmer. If it's not all shimmers in one palette, it's there's just, you know, maybe one matte color. And that's not really something that I find ideal. So fun fact, you guys, I have been wearing this um, eye makeup for... Okay, I had this on at around 4 p.m., let's say 4.30, and it is now 2.15 in the morning. And as you can see, I don't know, it doesn't really clearly show in the camera, but it still looks good. It still pigmented. The colors are all there, are still all there, intact, and still looking great and that's a plus how many hours is that so that's about what 10 hours of having um this product on my face and that is just absolutely amazing so huge plus um for this palette for sleek makeup palettes actually all of their palettes are like that well the three that i own i own storm and original and then this one and you know that's what i've noticed about all three palettes is that they are very long lasting. So yeah, that's huge plus. And if you're like me, that you wanna, you know, um, deviate from neutral shades, the browns and whatnots, you can get the On The Horizon palette and play around with the oranges and the green, blue-green ones in this um, palette. I am right now obsessed with, you know, trying to experiment with eyeshadows, um, making more colorful looks, deviating from the neutral browns and, you know, um, smoky look. This palette has 12 shades that you can play with and it costs 695 pesos. There, it costs, I don't know if you can see it. It does not focus. For 695 pesos, I really think that you're getting your money's worth with this product because, um, as I've said, it comes with 12 shades, all with great color payoff. There is not much, well, I really didn't notice any fallout when I was applying this. It was very easy to blend and apply on the eyes and easy to, you know, pack on. It is very long wearing and the color payoff is amazing. Especially if you know you build it up, you build it up as you go. Um, it's well worth your money, I'm telling you guys. So out of 10, I rate this Sleek Makeup Eye Divine on the Horizon palette an eight out of 10. So if you're looking, if you're interested in getting this, I highly recommend it. And I also suggest that you run to the store and get it unless you know you want to you want it to run out and not be available to you anymore like that good night sweetheart palette i'm gonna search for that one really and then the nordic sky i'm still thinking about it but yeah this one definitely get it so this is the end of my review. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope it was informative to you and that it helped you into you know making decisions whether or not you should go ahead and buy the On The Horizon palette. 
And if this was helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more product reviews. See you guys in my next videos. Bye!